Hey guys, welcome, welcome back. back. We're about to encounter Team Shout. No, it's Team Yell. What? It's Yell. I, I, no, I know, I know it's Yell. I know it's Yell. The channel just almost got canceled. Team Shout. Team Shout. They're using cleaning products everywhere. Team Shout. Oh, we here we go. All the way. This, we came all the way to this big city so that we could properly cheer you, on Are team you giving leaders. him a cowboy accent? Uh, why not, right? Okay, yeah, Team yeah. Yell's here to help. After all, you're in for a battle if you want to stop us. I'm up for that. I love they don't even look at you, though. And did you see his neck movements? It's like he was cracking yeah. his neck. My God, their they faces are so, so flat. Old. Well, the women look fun. The guys look like they're in their 40s. They remind me of like something from Ed, Ed, and Eddie. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, it's Ed, Ed, and Eddie are the team. Yeah, girls. they look like they look like Ed. No, 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 no. This one's Ed. The female's Ed, and then the uh, leader. I think. I, I, I think. It's double I, D. Yes. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Here we go. And double D. <laughs> <can be honest. laughs> oh How would that even work with two? Horns? I don't know. Would it even? Cry? You gotta shout at the low and shout at the heavens. You gotta do his battle cry. Wheel, 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 wheel. Uh, oh god. That's his battle cry. He had to burp. And he's gonna send out Galarian Zigzagoon. What I really like about this game is that, like, how it's not, like, trainers won't just have Pokeballs, like, they'll have different types of Pokeballs. Oh god, they, I thought I healed our Pokemon. Shit. Okay, we're fine, though. That's fine. Gus is gonna take him on, right, Gus? Use Quick Attack. No. Use Nuzzle. Oh, fine, one. If you don't want to <laughs> take my advice, you can just do, oh, do the stupid. Wait, time out. I'm going to switch out, actually. I might switch out. I want to give our uh, new member a time to shine. Oh, nice. And he's got a fighting type move, so here we go. He's got a couple fighting moves. Let's let's welcome him to the party, everybody. Gus, go. come back. Go Donkey! I'm so happy. I make waffles. <laughs> I make waffles. He's paralyzed, so that's even better. So, let's do... I'm going to do Rock Smash. Let's go with that for now. Rock Smash? All right. Don't care! Use Rock Smash! Well, wow. That, that oh, did a treat. boy! Way to go, Donkey! I think that's his only Pokemon, too. Oh, he didn't gain enough. What the fuck? You know what I'm kind of hoping in this playthrough? What are you hoping for? I, I might have said this in a past episode. Right. But I'm hoping we find some shinies. That would or, be like, awesome. at least one shiny. Okay, so... I'm gonna obviously change the audio. I, I'm looking at it right now, like BSD stuff that I'm looking at for audio. We've definitely maxed the mic out a little, or at least got full volume, but I'm gonna lower the volume a little bit. There should be a lot of volume lowering if we we're screaming shiny. donkey. No, and I mean like when we're when we encounter a legendary or no a shiny, because I'm gonna flip my yeah, shit. Yeah, no, seriously. Wouldn't it be great if it was a shiny of a favorite Pokemon? I know, dude. If it was like a shiny, um, I don't know who's a cool Pokemon. Game. Uh, Grimstar? I, yeah, Grimstar or Beetle, maybe? One of those guys? Oh, shiny Zamazenta. <laughs> it, no, they shiny lock. Them. I know, they shiny look stupid. It is stupid. I will agree. So we're going to paralyze this motherfucker again. We're going to do the same thing we did last time. And we're going to switch out for Donkey and make him fight. Right, Donkey? Get out there. You. Yeah. Did you ever, um, you know what I miss? What? Like old, like, like, um, like Urban Legends about video games. I do miss those. Cause like, um, there was a whole, um, you know, like Mewtwo behind the truck and like... No, that was Mew. Uh, did I say Mewtwo? I you meant, said Mewtwo. I, I meant to say Mew. You had Mew. Um, uh, you, you behind the truck, um, there was, um, there was the myth that, I think there was a myth that you could unlock Toad in Super Smash Melee. There's also the rumor that you can unlock Waluigi in Mario 64. There was a rumor, and there was a mod that actually let you play it. Yeah, there's plenty of mods for that. There's one that lets you play as uh, Waluigi. Yeah. And it's not Waluigi's Taco Stand. Waluigi Taco, Taco Stand. stand. Oh. I did that too well. <laughs> that was hard. That was in bed. Okay. Uh, I have a question, though, about Team Yell, because she had a towel that had Marty's face on it and, like, her body. Yeah, Do these did, did they like, take it while she was sleeping? Her eyes look like they're open, so maybe they were like trying to be sneaky and she gave them the side eye when she woke up. They snapped the photo and busted it. Maybe. So hear me out on this. Oh, he's going to heal my Pokemon up. Thanks, oh, buddy. Oh, nice. Uh, so hear me out. They seem very into Marnie. 
So what if they have body pillows over? Oh god. Like, don't they seem like the kind of people that do that? They absolutely do. Like, they just run into a stadium with a body pillow over and, be, and start swinging it around going, Go get him, Monty! I feel like I could cosplay as a Team Yell guy. Oh, really? I feel like I feel like I have the body for it. Oh my god, Connor! <laughs> what? Oh, dude, that's self-deprecating, but also a little funny. Like, I could... Well, it's more that, like, I have some of, like, a lot of those articles of clothing. Right. And, like, okay. if I could get, like, a fake mohawk and, like, a, make a horn thing, like, yeah. I could probably do that. Like, literally, you just need to get, like, two horns that you can find at the Dollar Tree, maybe. Yeah. yeah. You can do that. Like, put them together. But, you know what I think you'd be good at cosplaying from Pokemon? What? I've been thinking about them now since Watt, because my mind works like that. Since they mentioned Watts in the Wild Area. Watson. Uh-huh. Like, from Pokemon Hoenn. Like, from Hoenn, Ruby, and yeah. Sapphire. He's good. He's got a very cheerful personality, so I think you can do that. All right. I think you can do that. Uh, who would Juicy Lee cosplaying in Pokemon? I'm actually interested, because uh, I am trying to do that. Who, um, anybody in Pokemon. Like, who's, the, anybody. who's the guy from Sun and Moon? Who's the professor from Sun and Moon? Kakui. Kakui. Shit! I no you, way! Yeah, I think you can do Kakui. I better start hitting really, the gym, then. I really <laughs> do. Th oh, come on. Well, he has a six-pack. So? So do you. What? Where? Right there. Oh, my stomach. Oh, sorry. That was <laughs> too okay. hard. We just had fettuccine, so that's... Oh, yeah, we did. Soon. It was really good. Yeah, uh, but... Yeah, your sister makes some pretty damn good food, I will be honest. Oh, I'm, I'm sure. No worries. We were at uh, our st store earlier today, actually, looking for stuff. She kidnapped me for a bit, and this is actually always a fun story that I like to share is about anything that we have going on. Because anytime me and my sister are in the room together, uh, shit usually goes down. So... <laughs> Uh, we were in Market Basket, and she was looking for ciabatta bread for the um, gr garlic bread, the garlic cheese bread that we had with the fettuccine. And we were, like, walking up and down the bread aisle, and she was, I'm like, what if it's in front of the bakery? And she just goes, this is, we're in the bread, though. I'm like, <laughs> I'll send the name out. I'm like, what if she is, I'm like, what if the uh, bread is near the bakery with, like, the specialty bread? And she just goes, no, you're wrong. You're a dumbass. And I go, am I really, though? And we start walking that way. She automatically goes, "Oh, maybe you're right." I'm starting to think you're right. And I have my like my hand prepped. I'm like, I'm gonna backhand you on the arm if you even if it's there. Just you watch. And was it there? It was there. Oh. Boy. And I just backhand her arm, and you could hear it echo across the store. And she just goes, "You ass." I'm like, "Well, that's what you get for doubting me." Yeah. Uh, but what is it? That's not the funniest story I have of us. So there's plenty. I have plenty of a bunch of stuff, but. Uh, also, too, we thought we could use the bread, but there was a train-up facility, so we spent like five minutes trying to find hand-picking bread for me specifically. Dude, having a tree nut allergy sucks. It really I, does. I, having any, any allergy sucks. I almost went, um, I went to the beach with my mom one summer. I think it was last summer, last yeah. year. Um, and we went to Stop and Shop and got, my mom loves like those bagged cherries with the seeds in the middle. Oh, yeah. And I was like, oh, I like those too. So we bought a bag to eat at the beach. But here's the thing. I started eating them. My mouth started to tingle. I'm like, what the fuck? What is that? And like my hands started to tingle too. I'm like, okay, I better stop eating these. And I told my mom, hey, like, like my hands and my mouth is tingling. And she's like, you might be having an allergic reaction. Do we need to go? I'm like, well, I'm not asphyxiating or anything, so I might be allergic to uncooked cherries. Oh, really? I might be. Uh, that's... Oh, God. That... Oh, no. That... Which I didn't sucks, because they're you. so good. I well, didn't know that about you. Yeah. That sucks. Uh, well, I might be. I don't know for okay. sure. Can I just say real quick? What? Marnie over here, most adorable character in the entire game. She's, like, the best little golf girl in the world. Yeah. Oh, yeah. She... I like... Ev I know everyone loves Sonya, but, like, Marnie is best Marnie's girl. cool. Marnie is best girl. But back to the story. Now you have an allergy that I know too. Yeah. Let's go down the list. Um, what is it? And you have that. I have my tree nuts. My brother has peanuts, and so Your does and so does Brian. Brian, uh, Brian for those has of you, peanuts. For those of you that are new to the channel, back when we had a different setup from another friend, uh, our friend Brian helped us. He has a really bad peanut allergy. Yeah. Um, Autumn's alert. Like she's been on the show too a couple she's times. She's allergic to citrus. Citrus, yes. Um, we uh. At one point, Megan, I think, thought she was allergic to shellfish. And then her cousin, actually, if you think my our situations are bad, her cousin's allergic to both tree nuts and peanuts. Oh, come on. Yeah. Well, at least she knows to stay away from both. It's bad. Just all together. It sucks. But 
I would not recommend getting an allergy to anyone. Then again, you can't really help You can't it, control so, that. No. But then again, some people outgrow them and, like, don't have them anymore. They do. It sucks, though. But some people aren't that lucky. No. Which sucks. It really does. Uh, but, yeah, support your local allergy people, everybody. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, dude. Uh, I don't need to be escorted. It's right over there. I know. Like... I well, could I mean, have said they, no, but I mean, at the you same are time, a kid. You are a kid. But and... it's like five feet down the road. Look at this. It's here. And that's where we were. We could have walked. We could have walked. There's no need to ask. Oh, sorry. I don't know where that Tired. yawn came from. No. <laughs> you going to sleep already? I'm holding, I'm holding Pete the snail. I, f I forgot to mention that during this recording session... I've been holding this, um... Snail. Snail that belongs to, um... Pete the Benson's Snail. Sister, Pete the Snail. I'm gonna call him Pete the Snail. Um... Its name is Sally. Is it Sally the Snail? It, originally, its name is Sally. Let's call it Sally the Snail. Sally the Snail. Sally okay. the Snail has okay. an adorable little face and some antennas. Um, it belongs to Benson's sister, but I'm... I'm holding it. Hey, right look. Here, so. <laughs> oh, <thank you. laughs> Look what it look look what it reads upside down ass. <laughs> it looks like it reads ass upside down. Oh my god, it kind of does actually. Like if you look, if you like. Actually, go. it looks like an ups. You know those upside down question marks? Yeah. It looks like it reads ass. A ass. Got ass. <laughs> like it's a sponsorship. Got ass. Do you remember those got milk campaign ads? I do. Yes. There was one that my eighth grade science teacher showed us. Yes. And. It was um, um, it was a it was like these two kids and they're drinking like soda or something like that and uh -huh. their mom comes in like you should drink more milk to make your bones strong and they're like no um, we don't want to drink milk uh, Mr. Fredrickson doesn't drink milk at all and he's just fine and it's like this old guy mowing the lawn and his arms break off. <laughs> And what they're the still fuck? attached to the lawnmower, and they go. And he's like, "Oh!" And the kids scream and start chugging milk. Oh my god! I actually remember this. And I'm oh like, no! What? They released this. I remember this now. Jesus Christ! How could I not forget that? Oh, here we go. The gym leaders, everybody. They got like the, go. they got the badass monsters Inc. walk going on when they. You know what's the funny? Team. The gym leaders are different in this game than in Sword. Two of them are. Two of them are. Two of them are. And there they are. Yeah, like um, that uh, girl. The, the girl in the white is in, in the fighting sword. farmer. Hey there, everybody. My name's Milo. Do you think her and uh, him and Gardena hang out? Most likely. Maybe. They seem like they're identical. Maybe. Nessa. Nessa. Kaboom. Kaboom. <laughs> I love how the crowd's chanting like. Wah, wah, wah. Oh, and shy guy. Alistair. I mean Alistair. <laughs> wah, 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 and, oh and, my god. She gives me the creeps every time. Look at that nose. She's got like a whoop back nose. Ice oh cool. my god, she's Ice -type master so Melanie. adorable. Melanie's cool. Thick McGee. Uh, excuse me. I don't like this prick. I like him. I don't like him. He seems so arrogant. I haven't. We haven't learned much about him yet, but he's like such a prick. Yeah. He seems like such an asshole. He's like, hey guys, welcome to my live stream. <laughs> does, does he live stream in this game? I don't remember. Well, he has a phone, so I imagine he does. <laughs> welcome to my live stream. Welcome to my Fortnite Funny Moments Complimation. You're complimation? Gonna... Fuck, I can't English. The ass, the ants in my pants a proclamation. <laughs> You're a fucking asshole. <laughs> welcome to my Funny Moments Compilation. Fuck, I can't say it. I, I'm not Englishing today. Compilation. There we go. One of the many com what? complications of being the angel of death. Like, go fuck yourself. <laughs> go fuck yourself. Sorry. <laughs> That's your revenge for making the number. I M3. know. I'm no, sorry. I'm just kidding. I know. I'm it's funny. Too. It's yeah, funny. I know. In the stadium. I don't. I hate how it cuts off, though. Like, we don't see them interact with the gym leaders. But back to what I was saying. He's probably just like, watch my live stream, my funny moments. Like, and I'm gonna destroy this kid! <laughs> oh, yeah! What a loser! Now give me your prize money! Yeah! Welcome to my next Funny Moments compilation! Today, I'm gonna piss on Leon's statue! <laughs> I feel like he is the type of guy Calling me a runner-up loser! We'll see what you think about that, Leon! <laughs> I wanna be number one! <laughs> hey, are you gonna be alright, Benson? Yeah. <laughs> good, good. I was worried for a second. You, you should always be worried. This guy is just something else. He's stroking the three patches of a beard that he has. I know. <laughs> he was like, hmm. 
There's it, hair, and then there's oh my god, hair. it looks like a dude holding up something. You oh see, like god, there's the head, and then there's like the arms. What if he's playing like a switch on the bed? Like he looks like he's lying down. Oh my god, he's lying down playing the switch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's awesome. That's amazing. I cannot wait to like not like not be able to unsee that anymore. God, that strand of hair would bug me. It's bug seriously the crap bugging out of me. It's like the way it's shaking right now. I know. Ugh. Get out of here. Uh, yeah, go get. You're clearly the villain. Only a villain go has on. a strand. Now listen closely, you two. You both only just started on your path as trainers. If you want to win, you need to do more than just train your Pokemon. You need to train yourselves too. Drink plenty of milk and your arms won't fall off. <laughs> Let's do it, Vodgepodge. Let's do it, Vodgepodge. The first is in Turf Field. We need to head to Root. I thought you were going to say Turtle. <laughs> yes, it's in Turtle, Connor. It's in Turtle. Like in Turtle Monologue. <laughs> it's when a turtle thinks to himself. God fucking. <laughs> God damn it, Connor! I'm sorry! Not again! Oh, Jesus Christ. Imagine somebody animating that. Oh my, we haven't even stepped five feet out! Fuck off! Come on. A gift such a wonderful thing. She was probably just... flying taxis. Huh? They allow us to fly. Because <laughs> HMs don't exist anymore. Who uses HMs anymore? What a loser. I think HMs were cool, but like... I feel like you should have been able to forget them. Yeah, especially Defog. Oh, Defog. Do you remember that shit? Yeah, that was like the one thing I didn't like about the fourth gen was Defog. Screw so, that. So bad. That was the worst. Especially because to... you had to teach it to a flying type, most likely. Yeah. I taught. I actually taught it to my um, uh, Tropius. Did I, you? I because I haven't. Whenever I play Pokemon Platinum, I always have a Tropius in my party. Ah. Because okay. that's one of my favorite grass types. It is a good grass type. Um, so I always, so I would always give it to Tropius. Yeah. Let's go down here. Okay, what's down here? I don't think I've ever been here in my playthrough. Where do we go down here? There's a tree. Oh, I don't like where that's going. He's gonna sell us some crack. Oh, water! TMO2 paid it. Oh, do you have a, do you have a fishing pole? I think I do. Go I think fish we have in that hole. Go there. fish yourself. Oh wow, you haven't even tried to fish yet. We haven't. You remember? I don't think we did that in the wild area. Let's see what we get. What we get? Oh, you. I never would have guessed. Who would have thought? Do we have that? A magic carp? No, no we, have we haven't fished before, so no. Uh, oh, yeah. Do we want to get one? Yeah. Okay, cool. I'm going to tackle. What? Whoa! Holy shit! He almost got us there! Do you know about the... There was a rumor that... Um, a splash had a zero point, like a like a one percent chance of being like a one hit KO. I don't think I ever remember hearing that rumor. Actually, there was a rumor that it was a one that it was um, a one hit hit, hit KO, but like a one percent chance of it happening. What? But when you think about it, um, there's no way. It really could have just been um, them running out of power points. And just using struggle, which deals damage. Most likely. So. Definitely that. Right. So maybe that's where it came from. I really think it would, because there's no way. <laughs> this this weak, is such a terribly. This weak and pathetic Pokemon gets easily pushed along rivers where there are strong currents. As if. Well, that's not even it? much to tell. Like, they're just like, yeah, fuck, sucks. Uh, what are we gonna name it? I don't know. Shit. About, um. Um. Shit. We're drawing a blank now. Fuck. Oh, uh, what do you got? What do you got? Hold on. Let me look something up here. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Get right ahead. Um, hold on. I think while you look that up, I think this will be the end of the episode for now. All right. So next time, everybody, we are going to name this Magikarp Stay Frosty.